Breaking news on President Trump's travel ban. A federal appeals court just ruled to uphold one of the two bans on imposing the ban. This one enforces Trump's executive order restricting travel from six predominantly Muslim countries. NBC News Justice Correspondent Pete Williams joins me with the details. Pete, you can say this more elegantly than I just did. <laughs> Well, I don't know about that. Maybe differently is the way I say it. Uh, this means that the president can't enforce his revised executive order limiting travel from six predominantly Muslim countries. A federal judge in Maryland ruled in March that it was unconstitutional because it would violate the religious, it violated religious freedom. The government appealed that to the Fourth Circuit Court of Appeals in Richmond. And today that court, by a vote of 10 to 3, said the lower court judge had it right. The central issue in this case, uh, Holly, Ali, was statements by the president during his campaign that called for a Muslim ban. And the appeals court today said that was it made it clear that the no matter how the administration tried to dress it up, that the travel restriction was intended to be targeted at Muslims and therefore was unconstitutional religious discrimination. The vote of the court was 10 to 3. The dissenters said you can't look at a campaign statement. You got to look at what the the words of the ruling itself or the order itself, and that the government had a legitimate national security case. The significance here, Ollie, is this. They've got this case in on this uh, coast. You've got the other case uh, based on a, a similar ruling from a judge in Hawaii that's now in the Ninth Circuit. Both of the appeals courts would have to rule in the government's favor in order for the administration to begin enforcing the travel restriction. Now we know that one appeals court won't, so that means that the ban on enforcing it, no matter what the Ninth Circuit does, is going to continue for several more months. The administration can go to the Supreme Court and ask them to take the appeal, and they can ask the Supreme Court to lift the stay while it's seeking review in the Supreme Court. That would have to be its next step. We haven't heard yet from the Justice Department or the White House, Holly. All right, Pete, I know you're on it. We'll stay on it. Thanks very much, Pete Williams.